Question 27. A company purchases a machine for $50,000. The two methods of depreciation being considered are the declining balance method and the straight line method. Part A. For the declining balance method, the salvage value of the machine after n years is given by the formula S equals V0 times 0 0.80 to the power of n, where S is the salvage value and V0 is the initial value of the asset. Part 1. What is the annual rate of depreciation used in this formula? Expressing the 0 0.80 in the formula as a percentage, the salvage value is equal to V0 times 80% to the power of n. Now 80% can be expressed as the difference between two percentages, that is 100% minus 20% where the minus 20% represents the percentage decrease or the depreciation each year. So the salvage value S is equal to V0 times 100% minus 20% in brackets to the power of N. And this value here, this 20% represents the annual rate of depreciation. Therefore, the annual rate of depreciation is 20%. Part 2. Calculate the salvage value of the machine after three years based on the given formula. In the salvage value formula, V0 represents the purchase price of the machine. Now the machine was purchased for $50,000. So substituting $50,000 for V0 into the salvage value formula, we have S3 which represents the salvage value of the machine after three years is equal to 50,000 times 0 0.80 to the power of 3, which equals 25,600. Therefore, the salvage value after three years is $25,600. Part B. For the straight line method, the value of the machine is depreciated at a rate of 12.2% of the purchase price each year. When will the value of the machine, using this method, be equal to the salvage value found in part A2. The depreciation each year, D, using the straight line method, is 12.2% of the purchase price of the machine, which was $50,000. So D is equal to 12.2% times 50,000, which equals $6,100 per year. So the machine is losing $6,100 each year when depreciated using the straight line method. So the value of the machine using this method such that it is equal to the salvage value found in part A2, which was $25,600, we need to solve for n the equation V0 minus dn is equal to S3, where n represents the number of years that has passed since the machine was purchased, V0 is the purchase price of the machine, which was $50,000. DN is the value of the depreciation of the machine after N years using the straight line method. And S3 was the salvage value of the machine after three years using the declining balance method. So substituting 50,000 for V0, 6,100 N for DN, since 6,100 represents the depreciation each year using the straight line method, times n years worth of depreciation is equal to 25,600. Subtracting 50,000 from both sides of this equation, we get negative 6,100n is equal to negative 24,400. Dividing both sides of this equation by negative 6,100 to make n the subject, we get n is equal to negative 24,400 divided by negative 6,100, which equals 4. Therefore, the salvage value of the machine is $25,600 after 4 years using the straight line method.